JDM community is like a lifestyle or even a religion to some people. It doesn't matter who has the fastest or the best looking car at the end of the day because we all share the same passion. Hi, my name is Patrick. I'm from Melbourne. I drive a Nissan 180SX from 1995 and it's kind of an old rusty car, but you know, it's a car I like. <laughs> Definition of the JM community is a community of car enthusiasts that can express their passion in many different ways, such as like the build styles, colors, and things of that nature. It's a stress relief kind of thing, like after a day of hard work and stuff, you get to do something that you're passionate about. It could be anything, but for most people like us, it's cars. We can look for the next mod, build, do whatever we want to our cars, so it's like a way to express ourselves kind of thing. Yeah. Sometimes there are those days that like it demotivates you, you know, seeing like if for example if it breaks down often and then you see like the bill racking up. That kinda that kinda demotivates you, but like if you really like it then yeah, it just keeps you going. Hey my name is Kelvin. I drive a Nissan 370Z, nickname U Banana. At first, I didn't really own my own JDM. I got into it because of like I had my passions, enjoying building cars, looking at nice cars that drive past. Um, I only got this car because of my accident, my bike crash. Yeah, so I only bought this car to start working on it because of all the spare time, been off work for a while. So I got T-boned um, on my motorcycle uh, 17 months ago. Uh, life's been pretty rough since then. Still a lot of PTSD and stuff. Only had a seizure last week. Yeah, so don't really come out as much um, as I used to. Uh, yeah, just been in and out doctors, hospitals, physios, psychiatrists, you name it. Uh, normally I just stay at home, taking antidepressants, um, on a bunch of medication that doesn't really help. Um, but me sleeping, because uh, the medication does make me drowsy makes me antisocial, doesn't, don't really go out as much. But being in this community, it helps me a lot. Having friends there to support you from the beginning to the end. My car's still in a work in progress. So yeah, it's good to have friends that sticks by your side from the beginning till now. So I'm grateful for that. My mental health has improved a lot. I did have thoughts of killing myself and stuff as well. Um, it's 17 months at home really does put um, a lot of pressure on my physical and emotional side. Um, yeah, like I said, I did have the seizure last week. I did need support from my friends and my peers um, and especially the boys from the JDM community. They helped me out a lot. Um, they told me to focus on my car, work on it and see how it goes. So my name is Kyle. This is my Toyota Chaser, um, Series 2 TRD version. My Weekender is a R34 GDR V-Spec. Um, yeah, that's the only two car I got at the moment. JDM stands for, you know, Japanese domestic market, right? But the way I look at it is, um, it could be a Jap car, could be a Euro car, or, you know, any sort of car, right? Because we try to, you know, get everyone to be united in, you know, the same community. JDM car means, you know, buy a bit to me because uh, that's my sort of only hobby. And um, yeah, when work or life get a bit stressed, I just, you know, do some work with my car or, you know, play around with my car. So, you know, get rid of the stress, yeah. JDM cars in general, it's always something I go back to when I want to, you know, clear my mind, enjoy your, your, your night, you know. We used to just, you know, go hang at a car wash and, you know, wash our cars and just chill there and talk until like midnight or something, yeah. It's just stress relief. Cars are definitely not cheap, especially nowadays all JDM cars are going up in prices. You know, I could have invested my money and time into something, you know, better and could have got a better return. But I don't think I regret it because um, car brought me a lot of joy and, you know, friends along the way. That I think, you know, is prices, so definitely worth it. Hi, my name is Jackie and I drive a Nissan S13. I got into the JDM community when I was really young, watching all these 
movies, TV shows, anime, you know, stuff like Initial D, Fast and Furious, all that sort of stuff. Honestly, the JDM community has helped me a lot, you know, they've brought me closer to a lot of my friends here. Also, it's a way of me expressing myself throughout how I build my car. It means the world to me. Uh, I've worked year, a year straight just saving up, not going out, honestly, to get this thing. I was at, I was one point, you know, so close to giving up. Honestly, the, the market on this is ridiculous, so I'm grateful to be able to drive it right now. The reason I got the 13 was one of the founders of the group, Carl Pham. Seeing his Millennium Jade really pushed me to really get one. And yeah, people join the community, honestly, just be yourself, you know. Don't listen to anyone that's bringing you down. The whole point of building cars is to express yourself. That's why there are so many builds out there. Euro, JDM, AEDM, all of it. Just be yourself. It's an open market. If I hadn't gone into cars, I don't know where I'd be, you know. I wouldn't have met all the boys here today. I wouldn't be driving a dream car. I wouldn't, probably wouldn't have gone into photography as a side job or a side gig. Um, you know, cars are passion for me. And at the end of the day, it's a way of expressing myself. I'm Vincent. I have a Honda Integra DC5R. The community, we're all a family, basically. No discrimination between all the different cars and stuff. My cousin he brought me up around the JDM scene. It's more than just having nice cars and stuff, it's about the people as well. Having good mates around you who supports the same hobby and lifestyle as you. So it's good to be with a good community. The community, they are very helpful, friendly. Like when I first got this car, I bought it stock, didn't know much about the car itself. I went to a few meets, even though my car is stock, those that built their cars, they gave me a lot of guidance, uh, taught me a lot of things about the car, what I can do with it. And yeah, no one knows everything and it's good to learn from other people and the community does that. You meet new people, they're teaching you things. It's always a learning experience. It's, it's my pride and joy at the moment. Completing it would be one of my dreams, even though it's not the fastest car, not the nicest car out there. It's something that gives me a lot of emotional support, you know, like keeps me moving forward one day at a time. Your time today. That was so stressful. So <laughs>